Good evening. It has been a chilly few days and today was no exception. Only got up into the mid to upper 20s today. We did hit 30 in Effingham, but outside of there between 28 and 26 for our highs. And as we're moving through the evening tonight, we're already down into the low 20s. In some places, we're down into the teens already. And we, go, we are going to continue to see those temperatures drop, but we're not going to drop too much farther. We're only going to get down right around 19 for here in Charleston. Mostly clear skies though, but again, it's another cold night, another night under freezing, but we see those winds, southern winds at five to 10 miles per hour. That's going to help warm us up as we move into tomorrow, and that's exactly what we're going to see. We're out of the 30s. We're out of the 20s. We're back close to 50 tomorrow. 49 is our high right on average for this time of year, so it's going to be a pleasant day tomorrow. It's still a little bit cooler, but again, it's right on average for what you can expect for this time of year, and we're seeing sunshine throughout the day. We're not going to be seeing super strong winds either, so although it is still in the 40s, it's going to be a pleasant day throughout the day. And we're going to see that here on Futurecast starting at 7 a.m. There's really not much to see here on the Futurecast. I'm letting this run for you. We see some light clouds moving through right as the sun begins to set. So throughout the day tomorrow, you can expect to be seeing sunshine and very few clouds in the area. Moving forward, we're going to continue to see similar temperatures, but we're not going to continue to see those sunny skies. Thursday, we have a high of 50, so just a little bit warmer, but we have cloudy skies throughout the day and a chance for rain in the afternoon. And that chance of rain is going to continue as we move into Friday. And Friday is going to be even, bit, even more of a rainier day. 48, a little bit cooler because of the rain we're seeing. And again, we have that chance of rain throughout the day, but mainly in the morning hours in the early afternoon. As we get through the day on Friday, that chance of rain is going to diminish. And by Saturday, we're not expecting to see any rain, but those clouds are going to be staying in the area and will continue to be in the upper 40s or potentially the lower 50s this weekend. And we could continue to see some warmer temperatures. Our 6 to 10-day outlook for temperatures has us above average. Now, I just said average is right around 49 degrees, so we can expect to see those temperatures in the upper 40s or the 50s, but that's not going to be the case throughout the week this week. 49 tomorrow against sunny skies, 50 on Thursday. We have that chance of rain in the afternoon and then rainy conditions on Friday with a high of 48. As we move into the weekend, we're not going to see any more rain, but temperatures are going to continue to be in the 50s. 51 on Saturday, 53 on Sunday, so somewhat of a pleasant weekend. And by next week, we will start to see those temperatures declining. 40 is our high on Monday and then 39 on Tuesday.